Okay, I wanted to show you a couple other ways to hack the Desire to Learn ePortfolio. Um, you'll see here, this is actually not a hack. This is something that Desire to Learn allows you to do. You can embed a YouTube video. Very easily done. Find your YouTube video. Here it is right here. Okay. You take the embed code. YouTube allows you to put in fancy borders, what have you. Copy it, and then back in your presentation, you'll see you can copy that, paste it in using the HTML editor, which is the key down here, the little icon, and here it is right there. Pasted it right in and away you go. So, that's not a hack. What is a hack is, let's see here. I brought in some Etherpad wikis. So here's one here. The Desire to Learn ePortfolio does not like this. Um, but you can use a similar tack as you did as we did previously uh, to bring in content. I've got the etherpad here. I'm going up off the screen <laughs> to grab that uh, URL and then I'm bringing it in over here in the text area. Looking at the HTML source. Again, bringing it in as an object and um, bringing it in as text, grabbing the data from the Etherpad URL, pasting that in, setting a height and a width. So there's that. You can do similar things with um, blogs. And I've done that over here. This is a WordPress blog that I've embedded in. And I've used the exact same process where I've created an object tag. Now, the last thing that I wanted to show you was, um, and this is something that is not quite a hack, but it is something that uh, that's worth knowing about the D2L ePortfolio is you can have more than just the pages that are here, okay, more than just the navigation pages. I'm actually linking on the first page to another ePortfolio page, um, which I've created, which actually is bringing in another Etherpad wiki, but that page is actually hidden. So looking at the administrative piece here, under testimonials, that's hidden, which allows for some nice um, linking within and between pages. I think that's about it. Um, have a look around, d2luncomference.com, and if you're a D2Ler who's coming to uh, the Fusion Conference in July, then maybe you should sign up. It'll be a great time. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.